Before you can load Jeppesen terminal charts and databases into your portable devices or G3X or G3X Touched Avionic, you must load a chart view key so the devices can display the Jeppesen terminal charts. Instructions for that process can be found in the two minute video, How to Enable a Chart View Key Using the Garmin Aviation Database Manager. The video can be found on the Help menu under How to Videos. After installing the Chart View Key, go to the Jeppesen website and follow the steps to create an account and purchase your Jeppesen charts and databases. If you plan on purchasing all your subscriptions solely from Jeppesen, you can use the Jeppesen Distribution Manager to load the databases. After your initial purchase, you can link to your Jeppesen account through the Garmin Aviation Database Manager. The remainder of this video focuses on using the Garmin Aviation Database Manager to perform updates. To load your Jeppesen charts onto a portable device, open the Garmin Aviation Database Manager. A dashboard page will appear. Select Portables at the top of the page. Select Update Reinstall on the device you want to update. Select the box in front of Jeppesen Charts. If you need to update your Jeppesen subscriptions, check Alerts, or see the update schedule, Click on the blue More Info. A pop-up menu will open, providing links to Jeppesen. Select Continue when you're ready to move on. A login box appears where you will log in to Jeppesen. Also note the menu in the upper left. This menu will guide you step-by-step -step through the download process appropriate for your device. When you complete your credentials, select Login. If a license agreement appears, you must agree to the terms and select Continue to reach this Jeppesen service selection page. Notice the checklist in the upper left directs you to Select Jeppesen Charts. Select the avionics being updated, then select Continue. The Jeppesen Chart Geographic Area Selection page will appear. To select the entire coverage area you purchased, Click the circle before Select Entire Coverage Area. It may be pre-checked since it is the default. Then select Continue to move to the next step. If you want to select a smaller area of your purchased charts, click on the circle in front of Select Subset of the Coverage Area. This page will appear with a yellow movable box. Place your cursor over a corner of the box to shrink or expand the area for which you want charts. After your selection, select Continue. The Insert SD Card page will appear. Click the white circle to activate the drive. Select Continue to start downloading the databases. The Downloading and Installing Databases page shows the progress of the download. In this example, there is only one progress bar since only the Jeppesen charts were selected in prior steps. When the progress bar is complete, a summary page will appear indicating the updated information has been written to the SD card. Now you can select Done to remove your SD card. You must load the SD card into your portable device. This provides the basics of loading Jeppesen charts for portable devices using the Garmin Aviation Database Manager. If you need information on other topics concerning the Garmin Aviation Database Manager, check out the additional videos available through the Help menu or on YouTube.